This is Steve and Michelle Addison. They're in Leicester, England. So, uh, what do y'all, when you think of No Place Left, what, what comes to mind? What does it mean to you? Well, I, I think of, uh, I use the analogy of lighting fires. So, we're training all around uh, Britain and parts of Europe. But we want to we want to see fires lit in the hearts of the people we're training, and to see an, an interconnected network of practitioners who are mobilising others right across Britain and across Europe. So, in that sense, uh, we're not taking responsibility for one particular location, but we want to find the people who will. So that's what it means for, for me. I don't know if you've got anything to add. Yeah, and uh, I think for me, it's just uh, stirring people up, just sharing with them the excitement um, to actually get out there and to sow seed, share, share about God and His goodness. Uh, so to train them and help them train others. And um, yeah, so it's, yeah, just encouraging them to get excited and to then to get there, go get their hands dirty, start trying this, start getting out there and sharing the gospel and telling the people about Jesus. Yeah. Sweet. So what are you most excited about? Apart from... This lady? Yeah. Oh, yeah, good one. You okay. just got points. <laughs> uh, I, I, two things come to mind. One is, you know, we've been doing some training in Sweden lately. And, of course, wherever we go, we're in the world's hardest place and it's not going to work here. And Michelle and one of the Swedish girls she was training... You know, we're in a church building, they walk three minutes from the door of the church and God opens up a home and somebody who welcomes them in and wants to hear the gospel, wants someone to come back. She thought about attending the church, uh, thought, well, maybe when they're running a course next year, I'll wait another 12 months. Three minutes walk from the church door. And I think I'll leave it with that. I've got other stories, but otherwise I might take up too much time. But that, that really excited me. Well, and one of the ladies that we trained, uh, she's a pastor, but we trained her in the three circles, a simple gospel um, outline. And um, then that week she went and shared it and, uh, and brought someone to the Lord. And she was so excited, you know, just so excited. And I don't think that had been a regular pattern for her. But she found it is really easy if you just have... You know, a, a good tool and the yeah. desire in your heart to get out there and share. And so she did it, and now there's someone who knows about Jesus and he's going to begin following Jesus. So it's amazing. And then she can train other people, you know, how to, how to share as well. So yeah, that is exciting. All right, so we're looking for no place left Essex. Sweden, the whole world. And you need to check out Steve's book. Movements that change the world, what Jesus started, and movement pioneers. So check out those books. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you need to read those. They'll change your world. All right. Thanks, Jack. Thanks, Thanks. Thanks. Thanks.